there's another one. Okay, there are two gargoyles, but this one's already dead, so we got... <laughs> he jumped off the edge! He actually just jumped off the edge. Can we make the other one do that? Huh. Okay. I was expecting to fight that. And now I'm fighting this dude. Well, that was hard. Okay, so the boss fight is still going. Sorcerer Rogier. Okay, cool. Fog. Oh my god, watch him buff his weapon. And then die. There we go. Nice. Is there any more? Because the boss fight's still going. Oh, this boss fight is kind of annoying. How much harder would this boss fight be if I didn't have Carrion Phalanx? Like, so much harder. <laughs> just running around. Just spam this attack. <laughs> it is. It's just an autopilot boss. Well, that was rough. <laughs> hey, Fia. Say that like you were expecting me. Oh, okay, apparently you were. Um... No, I want to be hell. <laughs> I'm like, no, hold me, mommy. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> so. Do I make myself an ally of death? I think the golden order is like the Erd tree and shit, right? Yeah. Let's just oppose the Erd tree at every turn. Yeah. Like, fuck the Erd tree, hold me, mommy. Let's do this. When the first of the demigods died, his flesh yes, I have that. I have the scar. The curse mark, or whatever it's called. Has since been recovered at the Interesting. But there is, another is it the one that I've got? And I, must find it. I, think I, I think that's the one I've got. The there we go. I've got it. This is the other yep. How did you Praise me, mommy. Let's do this. People are fucking Rani best waifu. No, no, no. Fear best waifu. Let's do this. <laughs> what the fuck did I just do? I will soon lay with Godwin. Sure. And it will surely stir within me the new life of the Golden Prince and first dead of the demigods. This is some weird shit. The rule of those who okay. Um, what the fuck is going on now? She wanted me to give her the curse mark so she could bring some dude back from the dead so she can bang him and make a rune. That's... This is getting weird. Oh, there we go. Something has indeed happened. Enter the deathbed dream. Okay, cool. Things are happening. Oh! oh okay. Okay. Straight into it. Fine, I guess. What the fuck? Lich Dragon Fortisac. That's an amazing name for dragon, by the way. Also, look at this fucking arena. Also, look at that damage! Oh what the <laughs> fuck? Is he like, is he like insanely weak to magic or something? No, I think honestly he's level with the assumption that you're being counted in the round for the first time to find the up Oh, I mean that's a dope ability. Oh, well that's fire. Don't know how I dodged that, but apparently I did. Are you sure he's not just, like, really weak to magic? Because this is crazy. Wow. Well, that was a spectacle, but not a challenge. Hey! Yeah, Remembrance of the Lich Dragon. It's much more cool. challenging if you're not massively a Power Rage character. Also, yeah, mu presumably much more challenging in melee. That, w that was absolutely spectacular, boss, I have to say. I got his remembrance, and this is a rune, isn't it? Look at that. Mending rune of the Death Prince. Oh, what the fuck do I do with that? <laughs> it just gave me more keys. He used to restore the fractured Elden Ring when brandished by the Elden Lord. Form the two. It will embed the principle of life within death into order. Okay, so that, presumably, is a decision for one of the endings. That's what I would guess. Okay. That was fantastic. That was really, really fantastic. Oh, hey! This looks like it might be a thing. Let's murder this guy. Let's see what that gets us. Oh! That was nasty! Fucking hell. This guy hits pretty hard. Oh! The range on these guys is always so much more than I think it is. 
His weapon just looks short and stunted. Oh, you may be right, actually. Oh, sorry, this is a named one, Crucible Knight Soluria, and this is an actual boss. I thought this was just a mini boss. I didn't even notice that there was a health bar at the bottom of the screen. No, I did not. Oh, what the fuck? Did he summon that, or was that pure coincidence? <laughs> that was amazing. Yeah, I didn't even realize that was a boss. I thought it was just a regular ass Crucible Knight. So now then, let's head back to Landal. Yeah, I think I opened that door, right? That door wasn't opened before. Uh, yes, I think it did. Okay. Um, so what's the quickest way down? So what were the areas we discussed? I need to look. There's obviously the shunned blah 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 for the loathsome dung eater. There is this doorway. There's the area around the dragon's feet. Oh yeah, and there's a passage past the gargoyle, wasn't there? Let's see what's through this door then. Lightning proof dried liver. Oh, hang on. Is... Oh, this is the feet. Oh, this is the area around the dragon's feet. Okay, that's just the way in, another way into it. Okay, well, that, I mean, that kills two birds with one stone, doesn't it? This looks like a boss arena. Come on. But there's an item in here, and there's rarely items in boss arenas. Alberic. Who was Alberic? Have I met him? Uh, you fought him. Oh! Alberic was the guy who invaded me! This is the round table hold. Black Key Bolt, Two Fingers Prayer Book. I should probably actually, you know what, let's read some of these prayer books. Because I found some interesting ones. Well, I once entrusted to Tarnished Worthy of Lordship, the, order, the Golden Order's Fundamental Principles, Law of Regression. Okay, hang on a minute. I might need to get Law of Regression, because that, there was that thing which talked about regression. It's possible that I need to cast a spell, but it doesn't look like I can look like I can get up to the round table hold from here. Oh, oh yeah, I was gonna say there should be a set of stairs, but uh, yeah, of course but the stairs are all smashed up, so. But obviously you can get up because there's items, so. Huh. Okay. Yeah, I'm not sure how to get up to the top. Hey, that looks like a way into an upper section. Nice. Okay, here we are. Now we're in the round table hold proper. This is really cool. As always, it begs the question, is this in the future, in the past, or like an alternate dimension essentially that's been displaced? Because there's no real way to know. Can I open this? I was gonna say, if this doesn't open, that's gonna be such a fucking cop out. Do we have two dead fingers? No, this is a throne. Coded sword? What the fuck is that? That seems like a lore thing. You dropped a bunch of book on the floor. What? In the game. Rude. Um, yeah, I know. I know. Sometimes we sometimes we spill books. That's just how it goes. Sometimes we smash chairs by jumping into them. You know. It's not my fault. I'm hench as fuck. Look at this. You ever smashed a chair? Literally shattered a chair into splinters by jumping near it? Ever done that with a giant, you know, solid oak table? Oh, look at that. It's not my fault I'm a fucking beast. Okay, cool sword. But ultimately I was hoping for a little bit more significant secret lore stuff. This was a bit... Eh. Let's fast travel to Turtle Pope and give him the book. Law of Regression. Heals... Oh! That's entirely intelligence based! Heals all oh, ailments wait. and dispels all special wait, effects! Wait, is this a Golden Order funda... The Golden Order fundamentals which were... Hang on. Check out the... No, I can't cast any of the others. Oh, that just requires faith as well. Um. Yeah, okay, shit. I can actually just cast that. Yeah, you can. Okay, let's see. Let's see. I don't think this is going to do some do anything, but... I think you have to be standing on the, the, the right spot. The message, do you reckon? Regression alone reveals secrets. Oh! Shit! Okay. Radagon is Marika. The statue! There was a fucking... There was a thing which said the, 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 the person who made the statue oh, yeah. saw Radagon's secret and put it in the statue. I can't believe that worked. I mean, I'll be honest, I knew it was going to work as soon as you said, I think you need to stand on a specific spot. Yeah. 
But by that point, I was seconds away from finding out that it worked anyway, so... Damn! Okay, that's cool. I don't know if there's anything I can do with this information. That's so weird. There's just a spell that does that. I'm really proud what? of myself for figuring that out. Yeah. Let's go do the fucking dung eater. Oh, here he is. This is the dung eater. He's banging his head on the wall to the point where it is bloody. Leave your jail? Uh, do we want to help this guy? Fine. Okay, fine. This doesn't feel like the right thing to do. Um. I'm not comfortable with this. But it's content. <laughs> and I want to enjoy all the content the game has to offer. And this is content that the game is offering me. Is he going to murder other NPCs? Maybe? Uh, this feels like a Law Trek situation, except in this case, it's blatantly obvious that you shouldn't let him go. Um. Oh, fuck it. Okay, fine. We freed him. We freed him. Let's head to the round table hold and see the damage we've done. Oh, we have a summon. So we have a message. Sorry. Yes. Okay, a message. I'll defile you next. Come to the outer moat. Okay, where's the outer moat? I assume that's in Laindol. Like, this is... Is this the outer moat? That looks like an outter moat. Um, I guess we'll ride around here. Because, I mean, I, this is the only place I can think of that has two moats. Or at least two stretches of water. Two separate stretches of water. But this doesn't seem like the kind of place where he'd be, you know? Okay, but th this might be the wrong one. So it might be this bit up here. Well, this doesn't... Again, this doesn't seem to be the kind of place where he'd be. Oh, there he is. Never mind. It absolutely is the kind of place where he'd be. Who's that enemy over there? Because I thought that was the Dung Eater, but no. Oh, uh, well. God. That was tough. He couldn't even finish his monologue. Maybe I should have let him finish his monologue. I kind of wanted to hear what he had to say. Sort of Milo's Dung Eater has died. But at the same time, I didn't want to get defiled, so, you know. Yeah, Let's head back to the Table of Lost Grace. See if there's anything more with the Dung Eater. Because he's just fucking dead now. Oh no, he's back. Oh yeah, I, only, I didn't actually kill him, he just invaded me. Okay, there's more stuff. What? What? Are we getting meta now? He wants me to curse him? What the fuck is this guy? Jesus Christ. Okay. Um, he's very fucked up. You know what? It's been a while since my last break. Obviously, we're going to go do that. I don't know if... The thing is, I don't know if I should go do that before... No, nah, we'll take the break now. We'll take the break now. We'll do that at the start of the next... Of the next YouTube video. So, I feel really uncomfortable with what we're doing. I feel like killing him is in some way helping him now. Uh, and I don't really know what to do about that. I guess we'll find out. But again, doesn't matter how evil it is, it's content. And that's all that matters. That's all for now. Bye-bye.